What is going on YouTube? What I do? Hey, listen guys, no money, no problems. I'm gonna be sharing with you guys 10 mods that will completely transform your BMW on a budget. People always think that you need to spend thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars on things like rims and a wrap to make your car looking right. But let me tell you guys something, you don't need that. As you guys see right here, I don't have a wrap and I don't have rims. If you guys are interested in anything that any of the mods that I mentioned today, check the links down below. Use this gun code STICKS for 5% off and let's jump right into the video. Starting here in the front guys, as you guys can see, we have these beautiful M grills. They are in black. A lot of people get them in carbon fiber, but it just kind of depends on your taste and what you guys are looking for. They just make a big difference guys. Like these came silver. When you first get the car, it comes with silver. As soon as I put these black ones on, they made a huge difference and I'm super glad I did because it just makes that car look that much better for only $40. The next thing on the list guys is these beautiful black smoked out turning sequential signals. Again you can get these off Amazon but these bro when I change these let me tell you these made a huge difference in the car because if you guys didn't know the one that the BMW comes with it is silver and with the carbon fiber here and the black here it just doesn't make any sense and it doesn't look right so once I switched it to the smoked um, black sequential signals they look that much better it gives that car you know that look of like just aggressive and sporty so um definitely check these out this next mod is such a small mod but it makes a huge difference it is the BMW black and white emblems you can get them in a pack for like $30 you'll get like your your tires you'll get your front emblem you get your steering wheel emblem and as well you will get the back um, BMW emblems I think that the black and white looks the best personally but it all depends on what you guys are going for obviously I got a white and black kind of theme going with my car so I went with the white and black one I think it just fits the car the best and it looks amazing and it's only like very very cheap so all right you guys so for this next one I am inside the car and I'm gonna be talking about the LED strips that I get so many questions about um, I always get questions on where I got them from, how much were they, and these guys right here were $15 on Amazon. Um, I absolutely love them because I've had them for like a whole year and I haven't had any issues. They have different colors, of course. You got a whole bunch of different colors to choose from. I always stick with the red one just because it goes best with my uh, my dash. As you guys know, my dash is red, so I always have the red one, but as, you can also like switch the way like it can pulse or... It can you know go faster and whatnot and so bunch of different colors you can choose from but i always just stick with red just because i don't know i feel like red just looks the best but for 15 dollars, man this is a great upgrade obviously you guys can probably do a better job than me on hiding the LED, the actual leds but i think i did a pretty good job um you get the front ones as well as the back one i don't know if you guys can kind of see it but yeah you get all four of them for as low as 15 dollars. i think it's a great upgrade for your bmw for 40 000 or any other bmw honestly but yeah i love it so much man we are back in the front guys talking about the grilled inserts you can get them in a whole bunch of different colors i obviously got it in yellow you can get it like in blue red maybe orange there's a whole bunch of different colors you guys can choose from but i got this uh, on amazon again for like 15 or 16 dollars something like that but this is such a small change to the car that when you're parking and you kind of walk into your car the first thing you see is that because it's popping right through the black grills that we have here this was one of the more recent upgrades or mods that i did to the car but i absolutely love these the yellow just kind of pops and it gives the car that much better of a look um, it's going to match my yellow calipers that are going to be coming soon because i am going to paint my blue ones to yellow that way it can kind of go with this you know the inserts better but great great mod for 15 or 16 dollars something like that so guys moving to the side of the car we have the light reflectors don't do what i did man just buy this off amazon you can probably get it for like 20 bucks i did the mistake of buying of going to um a tint shop and they actually ended up tinting this with five percent but you can still kind of see the orange right through it i was a little i don't know i was a little dumb and i did that just buy it on amazon it's gonna look that it's gonna look a lot better I'm not gonna lie these are a little hard to take off but i'm sure you could do it with the right tools and just give yourself some time for you to you know do it but Definitely don't just go to a tint shop and get this tinted because when I did it, they charged me $90, bro, to just tint this black. And when I went on Amazon and looked it up, it was only for like 20 bucks. So don't do what I did. Don't make that mistake. Just buy it on Amazon for 20 bucks. Don't go and wrap this for 90 or whatever, however amount they're going to charge you, bro. All right, you guys. So these last three that I got for you guys are a little bit more on the expensive side, but they're not too expensive like, you know, crazy expensive so starting with the interior i got these new paddles that i installed a couple videos ago so if you guys didn't check out that video 
go do so after this video okay so these are the new paddles that i got um they cost like on 140 dollars i did get them from inline six auto so if you guys want a link to that it's down below of course but i absolutely love these carbon fiber you can you can get them in like the silver i don't know if they have it in black but i know carbon fiber and the silver they do have but i actually like these a lot the ones that i had before were just like a 3m to the um, oem ones which I, you know, I got rid of because it was just too much. I didn't really like them. I wanted these from the get-go, but I just couldn't get them at the time. But now I do. They look amazing, and I absolutely love them. So let me know what you guys think if you fuck with them, if you don't. But I think they look nice. They just go with the car very nicely. And, yeah. All right, you guys, so this next thing is my exhaust tips. I got them from Inline 6 Auto. I got the carbon fiber ones with the black inside. It goes with the car the best. They cost, they run you about $200, but I think it's... It's a great price for what you're getting. The quality is good. It looks very nice. Um, they have a couple different options you guys can choose from, but I think that the black with the carbon fiber ex exterior go best with my car because obviously I got a lot of carbon fiber with the white and then just the black looks very, very nice. I wanted it in black completely, but I couldn't find any. So these will do. I'm actually super excited about them. They look amazing and in the videos, they just look very, very nice. And so, yeah, I'm absolutely in love with them, to be honest. All right, you guys, last but not least is my spoiler. I've had it for almost as long as I've had the car, just because it was one of probably one of the first mods that I did on the car when I first got it. Um, it did cost me like around $330, something along those lines, and it's doing very, very well for how long I've had it, to be honest. It's probably one of the mods that you want to do right away, just because it gives the car that much more of a sportier look that, you know, we all want. I don't know if you guys want your car looking sporty, but I know I do. So the spoiler definitely does that for your car. And I'm absolutely in love with it. It looks amazing. It's holding up very, very well. And it's not too, too expensive. I'm just in love, guys. I don't know if you guys can tell, man. But, man, I love this thing, bro. All right, you guys, that is everything that I got for you guys today. And if you guys want to see the more expensive mods that I've got on my car, let me know down below and I'll do that for you guys. And also, if you guys didn't check out my full mods list video, click right here and go watch that video so you guys can see pretty much everything that I've done in the car. But with that being said, guys, stay grinding, stay hustling, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.